All right. <clears throat> yeah, this is a patron um, from Troy. They yeah, said the, this. Do we start this as a rabbit hole? Um, which, to be fair, people say, but I think we're at a point now with the channel where people kind of know what I like already before, like, do you know what I mean? That people think, what if he likes that and he'll like that? And chances are, I probably will. Um, but yeah. Uh, but we'll see. We'll see at the end. John Butler. Do not know him. Never heard of this guy. John Butler, Ocean. Live. Let's go. I'm just going to play a really short instrumental for you. Because I want to. And, um... Yes. This is a song I used to uh, sell on the tape called Searching for Heritage on, um, in Fremantle on the streets when I was busking. It's still relevant to me, so I'm going to play it for you.
Thanks. That whole thing was incredible. I mean, some of them little run at like the flicks and that was insanely impressive. But the sound he got doing that over, like the strumming, it sounded like there was a lot more going on than just that. But then I suppose it's a 12 string. 12 string does have that effect. But there's this thing I haven't said before. I've said a hundred times about guitar players that play electric compared to a player that plays acoustic. The acoustic's gonna be infinitely better if you if you don't play acoustic. They're gonna be infinite infinitely better because they can to make a an acoustic ring, the strings ring, is far more difficult than on an electric. Now you are times in that by six <laughs> with a twelve string. And he smashed that. They all notes rung and at one point he weren't even Picking, do you know what I mean? He was just um, like hammering it. But that was incredible. And do you know what? Yeah, one, we definitely got to do more of him. But two, I think there's there's certain band like Metallica. Metallica are really, really, really good at uh, uh, instrumentals. Like, they're one of them bands that can do it. There's certain bands that can, Rush, Rush can do it. There's certain bands that can do it, and there's other ones that can't. Um, but you can hear straight away uh, that he, like... I don't know I don't know what it is. I don't know whether it's a conscious... Having an understanding of the person listening to an instrumental that... Because Metallica is so good at that. that they don't keep the same bit going, and it's it becomes its own song and story without any words, which this kind of did really. And this is why I like buskers are bad for me because especially guitar playing buskers, because I get drawn into, like I could stand and watch someone play an instrument for hours, literally hours, like, and just stand and watch. Do you know what I mean? Like it amazes me still to this day. But yeah, if I saw him just busking, that would be bad news for me. Because I ain't going nowhere. But yeah, that was fire. That was fire. And like I say, for a first impression and it to be an instrumental, you know he's got some chops on him. Because at least I understand, like I say, an understanding of people, the person listening. Especially when it's an instrumental and you haven't got the words to tell the story. You have to make it more interesting, yeah, because you haven't got the voice. Um, but he smashed it. That was so good. So good. As, but that, how he was getting that to ring it, all, like it sounded like, like I say, but then like I say, 12 string has that effect anyway, but it did. It sounded like the Jeff Austin band, all of them. Do you know what I mean? When he was doing the strumming, Bit. That bit sounded like the way he got that to sound was so good, and I know that's like to most people that would be like the least impressive thing because of all the tricks he was doing in the other bit. But yeah, how he got that all to ring and how to how to sound off acoustic twelve string, yeah, was beautiful. The way he got that to resonate, but yeah. Nah, he's incredible. He really is incredible. You tell he's a proper guitar player too because his fingernails is all long. Like he is someone who's completely... Like even his body tells you what his craft is. Do you know what I mean? He's that dedicated to it. But yeah, fire. But yeah, that's the reaction. Sweet.